Hey folks, Dr. Bob McCauley. I want to talk to you today about a brand new herb I, we just found out about very recently. It's only been around for maybe around 50 years, something like that, as far as even just knowing that it had any kind of incredible uh, properties to it. It's very powerful anti-cancer properties. It's called U, Y-E-W, comes from the U tree, and I'm going to explain that in a minute. So there are many different species of U, Y-E-W, um, and uh, they're all over the country. And you'll see they're very ornamental uh, plants. They're very common. They're all over the pla place. And, um, you know, they, they put out those little red berries, and they get all over the place, and people step on them, track them into the house, that kind of stuff. And they always say, well, they're poisonous. They're toxic. Well, they are. But this is a totally different species, Taxus brevifolia, and it only comes from Montana. Big Sky Country, Montana, way up in the mountains, and they only harvest this in the summer. Okay, and we just do the tips. We used to do the bark many years ago. So initially, the cancer co companies got into this because they saw some some uh, some potential there uh, for some anti-cancer uh, agents in there called taxanes. And uh, so they've developed a product called Taxol, there's three or four others out there. And they use it in conjunction with chemotherapy and other cancer treatments. But not only does it have anti cancer properties, it also has a lot of other properties as well. I'm going to tell you about those. Now, the way that Taxane works in the body to fight cancer is it causes cell aptosis in cancer cells. So um, it just doesn't allow the cancer cell to replicate. There's these little spindles that come out and it starts uh, replicating a cancer cell. Well, it doesn't allow the spindles to come out so it doesn't replicate itself. And that's the same thing that turmeric does or curcumin. The curcumin, which is the active chemical found in turmeric, which is that kind of that orange spice you see in curry foods, okay? And uh, incredible food, I love it. The roots are amazing. But uh, same thing causes cell aptosis. However, the taxane that is found in, um, in Texas brevifolia, this, the tree, uh, the yew tree up in, in Montana, and again, it has to be from Montana, very specific strain of, of, uh, of, of Texas plant, Texas tree, um, so we can't get it from just anywhere in the country, but it also is very powerful anti-inflammatory. Uh, it's a very powerful antioxidant. It's a free radical scavenger. And it's also an incredible immune system builder on top of being anti-cancer. So this is really, uh, really an incredible food, an incredible herb. Um, you take, uh, you know, three capsules, uh, two or three capsules a day as a maintenance dosage. Or if you have a serious health challenge, maybe you got cancer or something, you're going to triple that dosage and do three of those three times a day. Take it with a meal. It's always best. You want a little protein with everything so your body absorbs it. Okay, it's yew plant, the yew tree, and it comes from Montana, Texas brevifolia, and the taxines in it. Check it out. This is really an amazing herb.